Come on, get a little closer. Get a little closer. I'm just kidding. Hi guys, welcome to my house. Um, let's get started with the finally we're doing an in-depth tour of my house with my boyfriend, my little boyfriend. He's behind the camera right now. Um, let's see, he's behind the camera doing a lot, but let me give you a tour. So first of all, we got our shoes. I we try our hardest to keep it organized and like keep it clean. But the truth of it all is, is sometimes my Crocs end up over here because I'm too lazy to put them on the rack. And that is okay. Then we've got our Zelda poster. Moving on down this way, we've got um, incense candle and incense and a candle. This is, is current storage. I would like to say that we will be working on migrating this to the Vivid Garage or somewhere else. But this is what we've been doing right now. Our goal is to make it a reading nook and get like bean bags and like comfy, kind of cozy reading nook because we've got books and stuff right here. And then we've got our lovely couch. It is green. Um, we got it from our from my boyfriend's sister, Madison. Um, so that's kind of what's happening here. We've got like a little dish right here. I'm gonna tour of the dish. It's a nail polish, a fidget toy, this thing, a tack. This dish is for my grandma. My Stanley. And then we have the TV. So let's come over here and get the TV. This is our TV. We built a lot of Legos, so we have like these Legos. Um, and then we've got our Switch and all of our Cards Against Humanity games. Okay, so come over to the kitchen. Come over here. Oh. We're gonna do a little loop. Paper towel holder. This is our sink. I did the dishes before we filmed this, so that's great. Dishwasher, microwave, toaster, ice machine that we don't ever use. Internet. This is where our food lives. It's not the greatest right now, just ignore that, because later in this week I'm going to be putting out and doing a grocery haul for you guys, like a big one, because we haven't gone shopping in a while and we need to go shopping, so we're gonna do a huge grocery haul for you. This is where we keep all of our plates, cups, etc. Yeah. The rest of our silverware, utensils, cutting boards, rags, everything is new. Then we have our oven stove situation, and then we have our spice cabinet over here. Um, yeah, there's a lot happening in there. There's chips up there. And then down here we just have the rest of our kitchenware. There technically is stuff down in here as well, but that is like a hot mess. We've got like, um, tools, more pans, a blender. And then on here we have my keys. I'm reading a new book and I'm really liking it. And I'm not a reader, so this is like crazy. Of me, but a court of thorns, a court of thorns and roses. Akatar is the series, and I just started reading it. And I'm obsessed with it. Anyway, another Lego set. My mom got this first for Christmas. Um, I think pretty sure I did show you guys my Christmas haul, but we built it and it's been living there ever since. Okay, let's. Oh, I forgot. Up here, water bottle, mail. That's not ours. More Legos of Tyler's. This is us. You should specify it's our landlord's mail. We didn't steal it. Oh, it's our land <laughs> it's our landlord's mail and we just don't know what to do with it. And I think we told him and I don't think he took it. Multiple times. A couple of times. I don't yeah. And then this is us. We painted each other. If you guys saw that on my TikTok, you're a real one. Um yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay, going through the hallway. We've got, first of all, this beautiful art piece that my dad gave us for Christmas. Um his friend made it and I'm absolutely obsessed with it because I think it's probably one of our cooler things in the home. Also, I forgot a whole thing, so we just have to like zoom this way. Woo! This is actually my favorite part of our house. Um, so we've been wanting to do this for a while, and this is why we held off on doing the record wall, or doing the house, sorry. This is why we didn't do house tour soon, was because I wanted to wait until we had this record wall up because it is so unbelievably cool. Um, so we got everything from Ikea, um, even the little like pull drawers. So if we're doing an in-depth tour here, we've got records, 
games. Specifically our favorites, Wingspan. I tried to organize it to like my favorite ones were on this side and my not so favorite ones were on the other side. But we've got like, we are not really strangers. We've got a new game that me and Tyler are gonna start. We've got Head Trip. Like these ones were like our, la our most recent Christmas gifts. And then we got this one, it's also a Christmas gift, which you haven't played yet. Tyler had some games. I've got more vinyls over here and my camera. And then if we're going into buckets, Tyler's got a bunch of cords in here. And this one is more books and stuff from Tyler's school. This one has my foam roller, my um, Farrah gun, and my magic circle. This one is also just random stuff, like we got new needles for our record player. So if we're going back up and we're looking at more Legos, I love like this setup, I think it looks super nice. Um, we built this for one of our anniversaries, I believe it was our six months. I don't know what I'm running out of it. Okay, this was our six month anniversary gift to ourselves and we built it together and it was so nice. Um, my record player, if you've been following me for a long time, I got it for Christmas, I'm pretty sure, or my birthday, one of the two, I don't remember. Um, Tyler's speaker, and then this is one of Tyler's Legos that we brought. And then the tree. The tree? What is it called? Monstera. It's a Monstera? It's a Monstera, and I also am going to plant a new one soon, but I might just plant it into this and then replant it later. That is a reminder for me to do that later. Anyways, follow me this way. So now that we're in the hallway, um, let's go into the bathroom. Come here. This is my shower. It's I'm gonna go like this. Yeah. Shower, super easy. Small bathroom is gonna be a little cramped, but I really just want to show you guys these. So I put these up. Really happy to have them up. This is my print when I went to Amsterdam and I went to the Van Gogh Museum. I got a print, and then this one is for my best friend Gigi. And I hung them up the last two years of college in these little things, but I wanted to make sure I put them up somewhere. So then we've got this situation. It's really like super nothing important at all. We just have Tyler's side, my side. We've got lotions and stuff and behind the mirror. Super chill, super chill. And then right behind you is going to be towels is kind of what's happening. But I'm going to sneak past the camera man so you can follow me this way. This is also another favorite part of this house. Um, we did these in is that April, six is April? June. June, six is June. June of 2023, which is crazy because it's 2020, oh, the end of 2024, so that's like awesome. And we did these handprints, and I took one of them with me to school. If you guys saw that, I took one of them, and then when we came back, I wanted to hang them up really cute. This was a gift for Tyler, one of our anniversaries, probably six months, I don't even remember. To be honest, one of the anniversaries I got this for Tyler because I was at school and it was sad. And then this one, I don't remember where he got this from, but it's a picture of him and I think it's cute. So, um, let's go into the office, guys. Welcome to the office. Show, uh, put a pan to this really quick. These are inspirational quotes that Tyler puts up on the door, um, and I love them and they make me very happy and they keep me going. So, I like. There's them. a new one every once in a while. Yeah, we rotate them. He rotates them, not me. Okay, anyway, so this way we've got this little jar. I love this jar, I think I took it from my parents, to be honest, but we usually have Tide Pods in it. We're kind of running out. This is a Serenity and Calm candle from my dad. He gave it to me while I was at school, I think my first year, and that's awesome. And then we just use this to house stuff, like dryer sheets, lighter, that thing, that. I'm doing laundry right now, so this is just that. It's really easy, not even a biggie at all. Okay, so panning this way, I want to explain my desk situation. I really like what's happening with it right now. However, our goal is to get rid of this desk and then just use these as like toppers, which you'll kind of understand when you see Tyler's desk. But anyway, explaining what's happening right now though, I've got my little cutting mat for sewing. I've got this, which I got from Tyler's grandma. I'm excited to start sewing. So crocheting something with that, but I like this well too. Um, I've organized this pretty well. I've got like my ballet shoes and my tap shoes for work right there. This is full of crafting stuff. And then I've got more, um, what is it called? Fabric. I've got fabric in that bottom one. Um, and then I've got my sewing machine, I've got my laptop, my planner, I've got this little like heat wax thingy, like it's mixed with smelly wax. <laughs> it's 
smelly wax thingy. I don't know. I haven't used it in a very long time. And then I've got this like heart shaped bowl, which I'm absolutely obsessed with. I got it from my grandma's yard sale, but it's literally just got pins and charms and sewing material. I've got my goals list, which I really want to utilize a lot more, hopefully soon. I've got my journal and my reflect book. I've been really working on using these a lot more, which has been really nice. I got a picture of my parents from when they were together and yeah, we're locked down again. More fabric, cutting stuff. I've also got this from my grandma. I've got a summer bucket list, which I have not even like looked at, so I don't know if I, I didn't do all of these things, but I did some of them. And then this is a note from my best friend. And then we've got chargers happening right here. We've got Tyler's laptop, my, well, Tyler's iPad, my iPad. Um, and here we've got like more random stuff, more random books, just kind of random stuff, not even a big deal. Let's go over to Tyler's side. We've got air purifier, amp, his fancy pedal board, his guitar. Right before we started filming this, he was practicing. So that's why it's kind of set up like this, which is what he does. With... What the heck? Okay. So then, yeah, we've got guitar. He's got his energy drinks, water bottle. We've got some more of these little Legos that we, um, put up around the house. Like it came in like a whole pack of them if you've seen it before, but we put them up all over the house and I think they're so cute. Um, then we've got his, you know, monitors, whatever, whatever. We've got a printer. We've got the black mesh thingy. It's plush. It's supposed to help with acoustics. I need to get a lot more. Acoustic, yeah. Acoustic. This is all my leftover from my college apartment. Yeah, so we are going to put, I think we're going to cover, we decided we were going to cover this whole wall with it. Mm -hmm. So that'll be happening later, which you'll probably never actually see, but it'll be fine. Printer, guitars, 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 piano, and banjo. <laughs> oh, and then this also. Okay, so then, then we have two closets. I am not going to go into this closet because it, one, it's, Full to the brim of my sweaters and my dresses and other stuff like that. And it's crazy, okay? And I'm going to be doing a video where I transition my closets for fall. So then we can get into, like, what that looks like. You can also go look at my videos from moving into this house. Because I did the closet organization video. And you can see that. You can see what it kind of looks like in there. But it's genuinely, like, the fattest mess in there. Okay. And then in this closet... Ooh, We've got shoes galore, we've got two buckets in the bottom, we've got a dance bucket, and then a win- don't look at my toes. I've got a dance bucket, and then I've got like a winter bucket with like my scarves and stuff. Um, I've also got like this bag I think literally has random clothes that I want to upcycle, so that is definitely a goal on my list. And then I've got all my yarn, and then extra bags. I think I've got roller skates up there too, it's awesome, I should really do that. And then panning back around, we've got our goals and tasks that we do each day. I haven't done mine yet today, to be honest, so do not look at mine because those are old. Um, and then we've got our board of the month and also notes from me. Okay, let's go to the bedroom. As we pass by to the bedroom, we have a, sh a half of the, of the shoe rack that's out there. It's the other half. And it's shoes that I've been trying to sell, which has not happened at all. And that's where they live here. And I don't know what to do with them because I don't really want to just get rid of them. I kind of want to sell them because some of them I don't really, I have never really worn. So if you want shoes, let me know. This is trash. Welcome to the bedroom. Anyways, so let's go like this way around the room. Yeah. I'm not allowed to open this. This is Tyler's um, closet. This, this little one right here. Um, I'm not allowed to open it because he has a birthday gift in there for me. This one, can I open this one? Okay, this one is mostly just random stuff, to be honest. Like, these are my slippers. Um, Tyler's got shoes, random, more Tyler's clothes, to be honest. I don't know. This one's mine. It's also a freaking mess, but I got a lot of clothes in here, so we'll definitely be redoing that, too. And then we've got this dresser. This dresser means the world to me, and... I love my whole heart soul. Anyways, it was my grandma's, and I told her when she moved out of her house and she wanted to get rid of it, and whatever, I wanted it. So we put it over here, and it fit perfectly, and I cherish it in my whole heart and soul. I also found a bunch of her hand sanitizers in there, so I have all of those, which is nice. 
I've got some dream catchers on the side. I've got a little jar of crystals. And then I've got like another little thing that holds my incense. My incense holder was out there though. And so organizing this when I put this in here, um, I do swimsuits on the top, workout bottoms, workout tops. This one's empty. And then I think I have like other random stuff at the bottom, which uh, I just don't really need to get it out. And then we go over here. Up here, we have a guitar, Heaven Guitars. It's Tyler's, not mine, obviously. And then we've got, this was from one of our first couple dates. We made it. So this kind of is like a little, another little like moment of like our relationship. Um, this is a birthday gift for our, that I made for him, which is like a bunch of things about why I love him and stuff. And then he got me this photo for our one year. I think, I don't know, we keep, the photo thing works out really well because we were separated and it was really nice to have. This is a Korok he got me on a whim. I don't think there was ever a reason for it, but he just got me a Korok. You were playing a lot of Breath of the Wild at that time. I really was. And I still love my Korok, even though I don't play it as much. He's not just a Korok. It's Kevin. Kevin the Korok. It's Kevin the Korok. I love him. Okay? Not much happening down here at all. We should definitely, like, think about using this more storage. I don't know why we don't. The bed. That's all. There, there's really not much to it. It's my purple minky, my, the weighted blanket, no biggie. We've got our, um, I'm Last of Us. Our Last of Us poster. Amazing. We got an alarm clock because <laughs> Tyler likes to keep his phone in a different room. So, alarm clock. More. Those were blue light glasses over there. We've got more blue light glasses because I have two and he has, like, one. Um... Oh, this is wood. Where wood? Where did this come from? It's from our lake trip. Oh, this is from our lake trip. Mm -hmm. And I also bought him some rocks at one time. I don't know. This is random stuff. We painted these things back here. There's like a note from one from our one year. He made this for me. I made one for him. There's like all these little sentimental goodies everywhere. This is the thing I'm excited about showing you though. Okay, we're gonna turn on the light and kind of show you a little bit more about what's happening over here. So on the side, I've got hats. Three hats. You've seen them before, you know, we love them. My Apple Watch lives here. This lamp can honestly migrate because I do like it in the other room, but it's so, I feel like the light sometimes is just not as bright as I need it. And especially for doing my makeup. So I like having this lamp here. I've got my um, eucalyptus lotion. Mirror, mirror, mirror. My sister got me this one. This one's from Costa Rica. This one I bought a million years ago. I've got this hair care thing. I've got some random stuff there. My mom got me this little like peace sign candle. I've got this. I think I got this at a farmer's market. But this is a shout out to Eva. I got this at a farmer's market. But the shout out to Eva because she gave me all these little tester perfumes. And I really want to like take the time to like decide which ones I like. And like which ones would be on my list of getting like a full bottle of. And then my sister gave me this for Christmas. It is a orange cup but I ended up just using it for change instead of orange juice which is like weird and then we've got those I stole this I stole this from um teppanyaki and now I put my little things in it so it's great um we've got our perfumes and our scrunchies I've got pictures of me and my sister and my dad and my sister again and then evil eye stuff my sister made me this um stamp thing i don't know i think it's a stamp not like an actual painting and then up here we've got this my sister also made for me gosh my sister's the best is what i'm learning right now my sister made this for me for christmas as well it's like a little thing um i got these i literally don't even remember where i got these from but they, they just house all of my like thicker bracelets and stuff there's a belt in this one i don't know why and then I have this jewelry box. I really like the, this system so much better because it's so much easier to like transport. And I had so much jewelry. So there's like so much jewelry underneath this too. And then I just display the ones that I wear most often, which I really like. Um, I've got this little strawberry guy. I've got this little moon guy. I've got my barrette that I got in Paris. And then I have both of my tassels from graduating high school and college. My Alex drawer set is literally the craziest thing I've ever seen in my life. Like, there's so much happening in here. 
which you really don't need to know. So there's random stuff, tarot cards, books, that one we don't need to talk about, that one we don't really need to talk about. This one has houses you, the camera, um, and all camera related stuff that I use most often, that we don't really need to talk about. This one has skincare, um, and club clips, etc. Moving towards the bottom, we've got my hair care stuff. Not hair care, but like hair products. We've got more candles and stuff and more bags at the bottom. I've got stuffed animals and my makeup thingy down there. We don't really need to talk about that, do we? Okay, I was editing and I realized that I never showed you inside of my makeup drawer. So basically, in order of from left to right, I've got my like lip colors, lipsticks, etc., my lash stuff, and then also a little bit of eyebrow stuff. And then we've got all of my blushes along with a little extra lip stuff. And then we've got my highlighter stuff and then we've got my skin stuff like my foundations etc my that kind of situation we've got sunglasses and we've got skincare and then up above everything we've got some eyeshadows but that's pretty much it super simple super easy okay moving back over here we've got all my bags if you didn't watch my bag collection video you're boring and you should watch it and there's also hats and stuff on here too we're not going into this closet because it's not worth it it's a horror show in there. You don't want to see it. Um. Oh, I forgot to show you guys that. My Noah Khan Stick Season poster. Really cute. Really cute. And, um. I think that's it for this video. What? Oh! Do you guys want to see my backyard? It's probably cold in here, but. This is our backyard. Um, so Tyler's mother recently got him slash us a, um, what is it called? Cold plunge tub. Oh, a cold plunge tub. Um, a cold plunge tub and he does it every morning. That's so nice. Don't go too too far, too crazy though because then they might know where we live. But then we have this, this is so nice. It's so nice in the summer because we love to like sit out here and like do stuff. By do stuff, I mean read. I don't sit up there and do other stuff. My trash cans right there. I think that's it for this video! What do you guys think? Anyway, that's my house tour. I hope you guys like this video. Please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. I got more videos coming your way. I'm trying to be more active on TikTok and Instagram. And I've been doing a lot of really cool stuff dance related. So if you guys want to know about that, follow my dance Instagram account too. And that's all I have to say about it. So, I hope you guys like it. Bye.